<sighs> well, let me go find Sophie and see what she's up to. Oh, that must be the door. I'll get Hello, Elizabeth. I haven't seen you in a while. How have you been? Oh, I've been good, thanks, Felicity. Um, well, what I came here was, uh, to tell you that I have some wonderful news. And what would that be? My father just found out that two new girls are going to be moving in in a few weeks. Oh, how lovely! Do you know how old they are? No, he doesn't know that. But maybe, hopefully, they'll be our age and then we can have even more friends, you know? Of course, the more the merrier. Well, would you like to come in for some tea and cakes? Mother just made it. Are you sure? Uh, certainly, you can come on in. My mother was actually expecting a guest. She didn't really mind whoever would come. Okay, thank you very much, Felicity. Mother, I'm here with Elizabeth. Would it be alright if she stayed a little bit to have some of the tea and cakes that you just made? Of course, Felicity. Oh, hello, Elizabeth, dear. I feel like we haven't seen you in so long. How have you been? I'm good, Mrs. Merriman. Thank you for letting me come over. Oh, it's fine, honey. You're you're welcome here anytime. Felicity, can you please get Sophie, Penny, Nan, and Mr. Moray and ask them if they'd like some tea and cakes? Sure, Mother. So anyway, what would you like to be... Oh, hello, girls. Sorry if I'm interrupting. Oh, it's okay, Felicity. What is it? Hi, Felicity. Hi. Um, Mother was just wondering if you guys would like to have some uh, tea and cakes that she just made. Oh, sure. Well, we would love some, right? Oh, of course. Okay. Come down in a minute. Father, how much longer do you think it's going to be until we are able to get a new home? Uh, hard to say. I don't know. Uh, no. Oh, hi, guys. Oh, hi, Felicity. Um, am I interrupting? No, no, not at all. What is it? Oh, well, um, Mother just made uh, some some tea and, uh, and uh, um, cakes. Would you guys be interested in having some? Yeah. Are you okay, Felicity? I'm fine. Oh, c come down in a moment. I hope she's all right. My word, Mrs. Merriman, the tea and cakes you prepared are absolutely delicious. Oh, I thank you very much, Mr. Moray. And the cakes are delicious too. <laughs> Nan, best you put that cake back down on a plate and eat it with a fork. We have guests. Right. <sighs> Little sisters. Hey, Sophie, after this, would you mind if I told you something very exciting? Oh, sure, Felicity. Well, Felicity, what did you want to talk to me about? Well, as you know, Elizabeth is here, and when she knocked on the door, she had some exciting news. She found out from her father that two new girls are going to be moving in um, a few blocks down, I think. And um, we don't know how old they are or anything, but hopefully they'll be around our age, and then, you know, we'll have new friends. Oh, that's wonderful. That's very nice. Yeah. But, Sophie, can I ask you an important question? Certainly. What is it? Well, I was just wondering, d do you like staying at my house? Of course I do. I mean, if it wasn't for you, Felicity, then we'd just be on the streets. We'd have nothing. Or nobody. I know. But it's just, I don't know, I sort of overheard you and your father talking, and I heard you say, um, when are we going to be getting our house back? Well, yeah, I did say that, but, I mean, I just kind of felt bad that I was being like a bother to you guys. A bother? Why would you ever think that? You and I have become such good friends, we're practically like sisters. No, I mean for like your mother, I mean she has to cook extra meals, have another place for us to sleep, do an extra laundry, I mean it's hard, you know, and we meanwhile could be staying at an orphanage, well, actually if we didn't find our father but you did find your father i know well let's not talk about sad things like that i'm gonna go back to the uh kitchen if you don't mind mm, okay Felicity, can I come in, please? Uh, yep, uh, I'm coming. I'm coming. Yes? Hi, Felicity. I just wanted to talk to you. I don't know. I, I, I feel like something's bothering you. Yeah, well, I don't know. I just feel like you're not telling me everything completely. What do you mean? Like, I don't know. I just feel like there's something else that 
you feel about, like, us or something, and I'm being completely honest with you, and I would not lie to you, Felicity. And look, I didn't- I just wanted to say sorry if I hurt your feelings before or anything. You didn't hurt my feelings. I know, but it's just- I don't know, you seemed kind of quiet and depressed all day today. Yeah, well. Well, uh, I'm just gonna- would it be okay if I just sit in here with you a little bit? Um, sure, yeah. And you're sure you're okay, Felicity? Yes, I'm- I'm fine, Sophie. It's okay. Okay, just making sure. Well, you probably want to be alone now. No, I, I I guess you can you can sit here with me if you want. Oh, okay. Hey guys. Oh, hi Elizabeth. Mind if I come and just sit with you guys? No, no, not a problem. Yeah, sure. Felicity, did anybody ever tell you you have a big bed? I know I do have a big bed, right? <laughs> you could probably fit a fourth person on there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, uh, did you tell Sophie about you know the new girls? Yes, I did. I know, that's really nice. I, I'm, I'm happy. I just hope they're our age, though. Well, maybe they'll be Nan and Penny's age, and then they'll have new friends, you know? Yeah, true. Well, it's still just the three of us. <laughs> yeah. So, Elizabeth, is Annabelle still tormenting you at home? Uh, yeah. She's never gonna change. That's just who she is, you know? <laughs> Remember? Banana Bell. Oh, yeah, Banana Bell. <laughs> <laughs> What's Banana Bell? Oh yeah, we never told you about this. Back when Elizabeth first moved here and I first met them, um, we made up this name for Annabelle. We call her Annabelle Banana Bell because she's like all mean to me and jealous of me and stuff. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. <laughs> you know, Elizabeth secretly calls her that. Yes, I do. Ugh, she's always like jealous of me. I don't know why. You know what I was just thinking? We should do this more often. Like, we should go to like my house or Elizabeth's house and just sit on their bed and then, you know, just like talk about, I don't know, our friends and family members and all that stuff. Wouldn't that be nice to do once in a while? Yeah, it would be. Just kind of catch up a little bit on what's going on with everybody. Yep. Well, at least everything is good right now. Yeah. <laughs>